a team Wednesday's workout. Okay, we have max effort sets to start with, and then we're moving on to your three three rounds repeats. Okay, so to start with, we're going to find three max effort sets of either handstand push-ups if we have the space, or if we're outdoors or we're not quite there yet with that skill, um, we'll just go normal push-up. Okay, so handstand push-ups or push-ups and we're looking for three max effort sets now we're going to take two minutes rest in between each set so the goal here is that you go to, to close as close to failure as we possibly can in each set so what i don't want you to do is hold back a few reps because you know you've still got a couple of sets to go we're going all the way in the first set we're resting two minutes and then we're seeing how many we can crank out for another max effort set rest for the two minutes and then go again so there will be or should be a drop off if we're going as hard as we can in each in each set now that doesn't mean we're going as fast as we possibly can okay so don't don't take that as a, i'm going to try and crank out as many reps as fast as possible quality movement and we're just going to see how how many we can do okay you're going to get extra reps if we're moving well as opposed to just flailing about for whatever movement we're going to use okay so if we are on the handstand push-ups and we're going say kipping i want you guys to think about from full arm extension, when we load our head forwards it's into that tripod stance, okay? Think about from full arm extension, head touches the mat, then the bum touches the wall, the knees tuck into the chest, and then we fire through back to the top of the rep again. Think thruster, okay? We've all done thrusters before. What are we doing a thruster? From the top of the rep, if I reverse it, the barbell comes down onto my shoulders, head has to come back. Then I send my bum into the wall in this case, or hips back to the squat. From here, I find my hips through, and then I punch. Flip that upside down, you've done your kipping handstand push-up, okay? The mechanics are the exact same. You're just upside down. So, again, from the top of the wall, from the top of the rep, head has to load out of the way. Imagine the barbell. I'm not coming straight down, so my hands are in line with my head for the handstand. If I do that with a barbell, barbell bangs on top of my head, okay? So it's exact same, head loads out of the way, um, head touches the mat in this case, hips come back so the, the bum touches the wall at the bottom, um, tuck the knees into the chest, fire the hips through, and then we punch, okay? Big pop of the hips, then a big punch. So nice controlled reps, how many we can get. If we're going strict, same idea with the, as the strict press, okay? From the top of the rep, head loads back, head touches the mat, Squeeze the abs, squeeze the bum, big punch, back to the top again. And um, if we're going push up, same rules apply here. So if we're in the outdoor classes, we're going to be doing push ups, unless you can find a tree to do handstands against. Um, so with the push up, if we're going from our toes or from our knees, tight core, tight butt, um, slow and controlled, touch the floor, big punch back to full arm extension again, slight rest at the top, into the next rep. Now, regardless if we're going push up, or handstands, I want to see you twisting your hands out slightly, okay? Instead of having your thumbs facing together, twist them up a little bit. That's going to switch on your chest a little bit more, switch on your lats, keep the shoulders in a nice strong position, okay? So with our push-up, what I want to see, regardless if we're going toes or knees, is hands <clears throat> directly underneath the shoulder, okay? We're not going to wide hand underneath the shoulder. Turn the hands up slightly. What this is going to do as I bring my chest to the ground, it keeps my elbows nice and close to my body. Chest touches the floor, back to full arm extension again. Same from the, the knees, squeeze the bum, squeeze the abs. Elbows are nice and close, touch, press, back to the top of the rep again. What I don't want to see is those elbows flailing out to the sides. Twist the hands out, keep the elbows in nice and close. Nice strong position, okay? Um, same again, it's not as many as you can do in a time, a, a, a little window, it's as many as you can do <clears throat> up until failure, okay? Until your strength completely goes. So, nice controlled reps. Um, quality of movement is gonna get you a couple of extra reps than it will would if you were just repping through them as fast as you possibly could, okay? So three max effort sets, two minute rest in between. A workout for time, okay? We've got three rounds of this, we've got 24, 18, 12 of jumping lunges and dumbbell snatch. So I'm going to go 24, 24, 18, 18, 12, 12. I'm going to rest three minutes. I'm going to go again. 
24, 24, 18, 18, 12, 12. So I'm gonna rest three minutes, and then I'm gonna go again for a third time. Okay, so three full rounds of the 24, the 18, and the 12. With a jumping lunge, as always, um, what I want to see is that front foot stays flat on the ground. Okay, don't let the, the knee travel in front of the toes. So, from your bottom position, my front foot's flat on the ground. I'm gonna pop straight up, swap, and I land, front foot flat on the ground, shin almost vertical. Okay, I always say it, trying to avoid these guys, where the heel starts to come off the ground, my knee shot way in front, a lot of pressure going through my knee. Okay, front foot flat. So, we got 24 of those, then we're going into 24 dumbbell snatches. So, nice flat back, strong position, big pop of the hips, and then punch overhead. If we're comfortable with the weight that we have, we don't have to drop underneath. It's just that big pop, big pull, big punch, okay? Ab tight, bum squeeze, bicep close to the ear. If we start to get a little tired, we can start dropping underneath. The catch, stand tall, squeeze the bum, turn. Catch, stand tall, okay? Every rep. Now, <clears throat> because we got heaps of rest here, we got three minutes rest in between each workout, I wanna see you guys moving fast, okay? So 24, 24, 18, 18, 12, 12. Earn that rest, go again, earn the rest, go again. Okay, so again, three, <clears throat> three max effort sets, your handstand push-ups or push-ups. Then we got your three, 24, 18, 12, with the rest in between, guys. Enjoy. <laughs> 